Well, should we do a profile? Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. I think we've gone through everything on the amp. That's good. Cool. Let me uh, plug some stuff in. Now, let me explain while he's setting up. We have two amps set up, and he has... um, he has to send a tone, a set of tones out to the. Um, I'm going to mute the amp right now because yeah. these tones are kind of bizarre. And uh, he's basically going to send some tones into the amp, and then there's a microphone. We're using a uh, Audio Technica 2035 yeah. for each of the amps, and then he's going to. It's going to listen to those sounds, and then it develops the profile. And then he will turn the amp back on through the board, and he'll play using the sound of the amp. We have a Fender VibroChamp. And we have Scott's infamous Gibson Plexi, <laughs> literally all Plexi. There is no wood in that amp. So, anyways, this is what it sounds like through the microphone in front of the uh, amp right now. Is that the uh, Plexi? I think so. Okay. So this this is a real amp right now. Right. That is the Plexi, amp. like as if he was playing directly into it. It's- Oh, it's a cool amp. It's a nice, nice spanked it. Yeah. All right, so, I'm going to mute you again. So. Well, actually, yes. play it again because now it's a new mic. So let's set the mic level and then new people can hear it with the uh, Sennheiser 6 and i That's your right. Okay, yeah, now we have sound because I have uh, in my little window on the camper it says uh, reference amp. <laughs> And here's what yeah. it sounds like through the camper. So you have to use a yeah. um, a cardioid that's you don't need phantom power. Right. Yeah, so. or or a, a, an amp that powers your mic. Right, exactly. And what you can do too, and what I know some people do, like they will put several mics uh, on the uh, on the cabinet and then just in through a mixer and mix that out into one channel back in the camper. So you know, however you want to do it. Uh, so this okay. is camper amp. This is reference amp. It's basically just going through the circuitry of the camper or not. Right. Okay. So here's what the real thing sounds like. Now I'm going to press the... Uh, okay, I'm muting. Volume. Cool. Mute. Uh, this, is this is where we're going to go this. into a 1940s horror yeah, film. Yeah, exactly. It's like the... We are in control of your television show. The space We control the vertical. The horror is coming down. Oh, that should be a pretty cool opening for an album. <laughs> And now we got like fizz or a, like That's fuzz. Swishy sound. Yeah, wishy washy. It's kind of like being in the car wash. And this whole process takes about a minute then. Yeah, around there. Um. <laughs> I like that one. <laughs> this is sounds a like quick. A... One. Yeah. <laughs> now imagine doing this in a, on a big cabinet. You play it loud. Yes, loud, don't loud. do this at two in the morning in your apartment while you're with a Marshall Ford. See, see the engineer walk by outside and say, what's going on, you guys? This is, uh... <laughs> it's supposed to sound like that. Don't yes. worry about it. This is just a little 8-inch speaker, so yeah, I can't imagine if you had 412 going on right now. With this. <laughs> yeah. You'd be rocking this place. Yeah, we, we should do that. All right, so, now we have a profile. Okay, I'm going to turn you oh, back. Oh, yeah, unmute me again, if you would. Okay. So this that's is, the amp. No, this is a camper. This is a profile. Okay, now can you switch back to the amp? Uh-huh. This is the amp. Okay, the camper. That's camper. Here's the amp. That's if pretty, you want, there, there's a... <laughs> yeah, that's that's, that's pretty, the look of it. That's pretty close, man. That's, uh, that's close. I don't, yeah, I don't. <laughs> uh, and there, there's a function called refine profile that works like this. I'm going to press it, and then I'm going to play some big, big fat chords for 20, 25 seconds. And... Uh, it's going to make it sound even better. Again, for reference, Kemper. Real amp. It's a little bit different. It's a little fat. A little well, different. you're here in the room. In the other two. Kemper. Reference. And I'm going to refine uh, the profile. This won't be pretty, but, you know, bear with me. Mute it. Not leave it. I learned all these chords at Guitar Center. <laughs> now here's the Kemper. Add a little clarity to it. Here's a real amp. 
That's that is amazing. There's a difference. All right, Jeff, go over there. Show show, show Jeff which button it is that you press the switch between them. I just mm-hmm. want to hear Jeff just like just switch them back and forth while you're playing, not cool. stopping playing. See so Kemper amp or reference amp, so just press either. So we're of those. starting on the. Do the do the volume on your guitar between both sure. of them. Uh, here's the real amp first. Here's Kemper doing about the same thing. Okay, now try your your gain on the Kemper. See how you can mod it. It's nice. Obviously, the plexi wouldn't overdrive that much. But you got a pretty decent OCDs and toners. I don't know if you notice, but it has this real attack compression thingy that the amp actually has. If I do it on the. Of course, I can hear as I'm doing the profile, I get tube shape, power zagging, clarity. I get all those parameters that will end up under amplifier later. I can't thank you a much for, uh, uh, enough to, for being here. It's just, it's just really a pleasure. This is such a cool amp, and now I understand it. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's so wild. That, that, just, yeah. yeah, just hearing that plexi and hearing it just between them. <coughs> right. Just the having difference. you go through it. Big yeah, difference. Yeah, I yeah, know we, we've had a lot of people, you know, like, you know, skeptics, uh, skeptics as I was, you know, and then they sit down and really, really where the magic happens is when you play it and it's how much it feels like a real amp. Right. It's, it's pretty cool. Okay. Uh, go ahead and, and if you just want to give us a groove, we'll take that out with us. And you're on. Oh, I mean, now you're on. And everybody have a great week. We will see you next week.